James. Been a, been a while since we've seen you. Uh, been a long, long, long winter. It has um, since Tour of Britain. Uh, yeah, it's been a long winter. I've kind of like been doing a bit of cross and uh, dabbling here, there, and doing a bit some of, like of my events, and and then hit the ground running with Drentha and yeah, onto a long season now. So what are your what are your goals? Because you you're, you're now, as you just said on stage, one of the experienced guys in the peloton. I know it's bizarre saying that because I just feel like I've always been the youngest rider at every team I beat it. But um, uh, but yeah, I'm ex- I'm excited to kind of take on a new role and uh, try and you know be a sl- bit of a road captain kind of um, character on the bike and uh, yeah I mean excited to take a, b- a bit of a new role on that in, in that regard and uh, hopefully then get up there in some of the races um, because I feel good this year and I feel like training's been going well and kit's good and team's awesome so yeah I'm excited. What, what have you learned over the years because you know I remember the early days you know you were still feeling your way into the, into the sport. Yeah, uh, it's it's I know I know the circuit now <laughs> pretty well, so I, I kind of like um, I don't stress too much. Um, I even had to, uh, did Drenthe with Adam, and he was like, you know, you change rider because you're not stressing about positioning, and it's kind of you you know I'm I kind of aware of my ability now, so I can kind of move out the outside, and I'm not kind of like fretting a bit. So I don't know. You after a couple of years, you just get into it, and it's kind of yeah, get on the roller coaster again, and uh, year goes by, and then on to the next one. More confidence knowing that you've reached it, at this level. And, and yeah, I think it's know. definitely more confidence. And then, especially I've done you know a fair few HC and Tour de Yorkshire's. Now this would be if I get into it, it would be my fourth Tour de Yorkshire. Um, uh, so yeah, third Tour of Britain. So I've kind of like I've done a fair few races now. So I feel like yeah, so no, nothing's going to be as hard as what I've already done. So yeah, no, it's so good. If you made the Tour of Yorkshire. What would be the goal there? Uh, getting breaks and. Uh, try and get up there for a jersey that'd be that'd be incredible if we could get as sprints points um even combative rider jersey that'd be amazing for the getting team if, i think yeah i think getting on the podium would be incredible yeah but it's such a hard race and it's four days this year um uh, everyone wants to do well there so yeah it's exciting um uh, but yeah if we can better last year then we're on to a winner Yeah, it's always super nerve-wracking. I go into it kind of like super nervous into the first race, but um, at first Prem's always fairly nerve-wracking because no one really knows, you know, who's going where, well, who's not going so well. Um, uh, but yeah, I'm kind of excited to see what kind of Holdsworth and um, Team Ribble and Vitus, all these new teams that, and see what kind of they're going to bring to the table. But we got six, is it six continental teams now? So I think, uh, you know, we've got... A, you know, good base there for British racing. So I think it's going to be some hard racing out there, all you know, throughout the whole season. And Tour Series is going to be another hard fight. <laughs> how do you benchmark? How do you benchmark your form going into those races? Uh, we've been lucky enough to go off to Holland and France, and so then you kind of can gauge where you're at with those guys who've been racing a lot um, uh, with in these HD races, who've done Dubai, Qatar, and all that. So you can kind of roughly gauge where you are. And then you get back to the UK and you should be able to find out where, where you kind of sit. But basically, first prem is where, is where we'll see where people are at. And, and surely, that's a, quite a tough one. Wrong climb. Surely, surely it's tough. It suits me because it's got that kind of grippier climb and then it kind of uh, crosswind over the, over the top. So it kind of splits up a little bit. And then nice, nice fast descent, which I'm always keen for. So that'll be the big test for everyone um, uh, but yeah I'm excited to see what everyone's going to bring to the table and hopefully we can come out on top but then there's some riders that have gone to Commonwealth Games so you know it'll be, it'll be an interesting test yeah, one so. final thing I've got to mention Bristol because that, that's got to be just down the road from here it is yeah yeah it's not far away I'm yeah I'm excited to get there hopefully we'll have some fan clubs there we'll see last yeah. last time I went to fin- Tour Britain finished in Bristol I, uh, I came to the finish line with cardboard cutouts of myself <laughs> and so that was quite eventful um, uh, so I'm hoping that will that will come back and uh, yeah I'll make yeah no I'm excited it's a prem to look forward to it's a prem to look forward to for sure yeah yeah right. thanks James, thank, thank you, you.